Hello Year 3, it's Mrs Byrne here. This week we're going to be looking at some Egyptian poetry. Now there's some quite tricky words in this, so we'll read it together. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. The Sphinx by Carl Sandberg. Closed mouth you sat 5,000 years and never let out a whisper. Processions came by, marchers asking questions. You answered with grey eyes, never blinking, shut lips, never talking. Not one croak of anything you know has come from your cat crouch of ages. I am one of those who know all you know and I keep my questions. I know the answers you hold. The Crocodile How doth the little crocodile improve his shining tail and pour the waters of the Nile on every golden scale? How cheerfully he seems to grin, how neatly spreads his claws and welcomes little fishies in with gently smiling jaws. Queen Nefertiti Spin a coin, spin a coin, all fall down. Queen Nefertiti stalks through town. Over the pavements her feet go clack, her legs are as tall as a chimney stack. Her fingers flicker like snakes in the air, the walls split open at her green-eyed stare. Her voice is thin as a ghost of bees. She will crumble your bones, she will make you freeze. Spin a coin, spin a coin, all fall down. Queen Nefertiti stalks through town. Wrapping Tutankhamun by Jane Clark. Tutankhamun's dead, long live the king. Let's get on down to the mummifying. He may be dead, but he's looking well. We pickled him in Natron so that he don't smell. Are his insides out? Has his body been stuffed? Then let's get wrapping, we've checked enough. Go under and over, criss-cross that strapping, keep overlapping, come on, get wrapping. He wasn't very bright when alive, so it's said, but he hasn't got a brain in his head, now he's dead. We dragged it through his nostrils with a long, thin hook. It showed us how to do it on our mommy's picture book. If he's going to live forever, we don't want no mishaps. So come on, everybody, let's get him under wraps. Go under and over, criss-cross that strapping, keep overlapping, come on, get wrapping. Put a scarab where his heart was. Yeah, that's terrific. Is his name written on it in hieroglyphics? That about wraps it up. He sure looks neat. From the top of his head to the soles of his feet. We're wrapping Tutankhamun for the future to see. So let's get wrapping for eternity. Go under and over. Crisscross that strapping. Keep overlapping. Come on, get wrapping. Voices from the Pharaoh's tomb. Chill winds across the desert probe. The night dark entrance to a tomb, and metres deep within stone walls, beyond the ears of gods or men, a spirit voice cries out. How many years have I lain here? I cannot tell, I cannot tell. Have only known the pain of death from my first journey here till now, abandoned and bereft. Even the gods deserted me, they too were thieves, they too took all. They took my son, my life, my joys, laughter of children still to come, dream upon dreams snuffed out. Within four coffins shut me tight, each tomb a treasure trove of jewels, cornelian quartz, cool ivory, bright blue of lapis lazuli, Collars of gold to shackle me, silks of deceit to clothe my corpse, great masks pressed close against my face, darkness to dull the memory of all that life had been. Chattels were all they left to me, room upon room in crazy piles, gold thrones and chariots, walking sticks, scepters and stools, rare amulets, sad bunches of dried flowers. And these my cats, which long ago wrapped sinuous bodies round my feet and purred and preened and licked my hand, are brittle skeletons, warm thin, within grey, rotting bands. Even these dusty memories, men have removed, men have erased, cold walls close in on empty space, my soul can find no place to rest, my spirit no release. 
Weak curses from dark shadows seep. They wither on the desert air, and deep within a barren tomb, a boy, a king, weeps golden tears. Tutum Carmoon. To make a pyramid, take 36 syllables, 8 lines, some spaces in between, a dash of logic and mix with a few grains of desert sand. Peak place, proudly providing prestigious, plush, private, piled penthouse, perfectly planned, panoramic position, part payment possible, past pharaohs preferred. <laughs>